Following the heartbreaking death of 45-year-old Sudan, the world's last male northern white rhino last year in Kenya, only two surviving female members of the species remained. In what seemed like lost hope for ever having white rhinos, the International Consortium of Scientists and Conservationists have now revealed that the first ever test tube baby rhinos will be born should the harvested and fertilized eggs become embryos. Expressing optimism, the scientists have revealed that of those 10 eggs, seven were successfully matured using a technique called intracytoplasm sperm injection or ICSI. The sperm came from two white rhino bulls, Sunni and South, who lived in a zoo in the Czech Republic prior to their death. In a statement, the scientists said, and I quote, This is the next critical step in hopefully creating viable embryos that can be frozen and then later on transferred to southern white rhino surrogate mothers. We were surprised by the high rate of maturation achieved as we do not get such a high rate with southern white rhino females in European zoos. End of quote. John Waweru, KWS Director General, added, and I quote, We are delighted that this partnership gets us one step closer to prevent extinction of the northern white rhinos. End of quote. The ultimate goal is to create a herd of at least five animals that could be returned to their natural habitat in Africa. That could take decades. It will be about 10 days before it is known whether the eggs have become embryos. White rhinos are considered near threatened, according to the World Wildlife Fund. Rhinos are the second largest land mammal after elephants. The white rhinoceros consists of two subspecies, the southern white rhino and the much rarer and critically endangered northern white rhino. Kenya had 20,000 rhinos in the 1970s, but years of rampant poaching reduced the number to an estimated 650 now, almost all of which are black rhinos. Winnie Lubembe for Ebru TV.